Dreams make me feel like I can predict the future, to do things that I know that I should or want to do, but sometimes I don't have the guts to. I'm dreaming a lot about travel. Normally traveling alone, I don't know what that says about me, but I like to travel to places that I've never been in real life, apparently. The last dream I can remember, I was buying a vintage coat in a little vintage shop and I found a ticket in the pocket and it belonged to Queen Anne, randomly. I dream of the great outdoors a lot and nature and swimming in the sea and walking through the forest. Shopping and styling new clothes that I don't even own yet. I think my dreams come from my subconscious spirit. From a lot of holding on. Maybe it's giving you signs. Maybe it's my alter ego. <laughs> I would describe my dreams with the colour yellow. I think it's a very harmonious colour, it's very neutral. Nudes, pinks, lots of pastel colours. The nicest dream I can remember is swimming in the sea and the sun was on the water and it was all crystally and sparkly and I could feel like the sun on my skin. My dreams actually have never taken me anywhere that I don't think exists on the planet. The world we live in is such a magical place I don't really dream of anywhere else. My dreams do take me to an imaginary world sometimes, but they're really hard to describe. I think I watch too much Game of Thrones. Because they're so imaginary, I couldn't put words into what they are because they're not tangible, real things in our tangible, material world. If I can soundtrack my dreams, actually, I would say that it would either be classical music, like a harp, <laughs> or it would be really grimy, like drum and bass. My dreams definitely do affect my mood. When you get up and the item that you bought in your dream is not in your closet, it makes getting dressed that morning really, really difficult. If it's been an amazing dream, I'm like, oh, I don't want to come out of it. I want to stay in it. Yes, I definitely think I can achieve my dreams. I've already achieved a, a, a whole lot of my dreams. <laughs> my dream for the future is happiness, uh, peacefulness, and a really big boat. I'm starting to dream about designing instead of buying. Playing and making mistakes and joy is such an important part of our lives, and so many of us are consumed with being perfect. So I want to help people to learn how not to be perfect anymore. Dream is the new fragrance by Ghost. Find out more at ghostfragrances.com.